fortunately, it seems that the aliens are content with just orbiting Ferguson. They're not bombarding us at the moment. Now, I was thinking about this yesterday, um, because I thought that I might play f for a bit today, and I came up with a plan that we might send a small shuttlecraft or one of the ships that we have to the orbit to see if the aliens will attack. On the other hand, I'm not sure if we should provoke them. That's uh, never a good idea. Seven so mining colony on a while has been expanded. Are we even buying stuff from wild? Why are you mining? Duranium, Corbomite and Sorium. Yes, we are definitely buying from you. Uh, aren't we? Yes, we're purchasing the, mi uh, the mineral output. Let me see how we're doing on Earth. Yeah, the stockpiles are plentiful. We are especially uh, proud of the sorium and galacid supply. Duranium, not that good. Neutronium, not that good either. But we have a lot of boronide and other as well. Damn, I need to close that steam thing. It's been driving me mad. Forgot about it. Sorry, guys. Okay, uh, cargo interstellar groups are moving here and there. But don't we have some... Cargo group 5 is moving to Earth. Okay, I guess we diverted all to Barnard now. <laughs> Interesting. Though the situation with the alien has been... Taking quite some time now, so I'm not surprised. Mm, oh, we're halfway through April. That's good. So just May, June, July, and we got some of the technologies so we are running for. Looking forward to that happening. Yeah, man, game. Come yeah, man. Oh, man. I did not miss the turn processing time. But it has to be done. It has to be done. Oh, another maintenance problem? Come on. A fire control. Damn. Now I'm pretty sure that when we're going to redesign the monitor we won't really be able to rebuild our ships to it. It's going to be way too expensive. But we shall see. Last time when we uh, were rebuilding some of the ships. I remember it took more time than it took to build the new ships. That was retarded. Mm. So this won't be it. Come on, game, show me what you got. Oh my god, so many maintenance problems. Mm. Oh yeah, I see that you got... What's the problem? That's the sodium harvest of with one. Uh, what did I do wrong? Oh, because one of them... Yeah, you know what? We need to equalize fuel. That's the problem. What was it? Okay, and now they will immediately move... to 
towards the system, correct? How could one have less fuel than the other since we are... Okay, nothing. The game probably didn't process it yet. Come on. Okay, okay, I'll give you five days. Huh? Nothing? What the hell is the problem here? Hmm. You are already there. Fuel tank's full. I don't feel. And move the sodium gas giant. Oh, they must be full. Oh, I'm, I'm so retarded. Okay, never mind. Never mind. Uh, I don't know why. I think it's like your fuel things are 90% or above. Damn. Soul traffic control is not bored. There are so many ships passing through. Okay, we're approaching May. Actually, after this time increment, we will be uh, in May. It's 1st of May, I think. 2215. 2215 meaning the hours, not year. 2101 is the year. Hey, that sounds pretty cool. 1st of May, 2101, 2215. The great accident happened. So that won't be what's going to happen. Um, if these aliens would just piss off. I mean, nobody asked for them. You goddamn kids, get the hell away of, from my lawn. Oh, and we finished a research lab. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. So let's uh, put it to good use. Can you guys use another one? Yes, 20th of July. Perfect. Perfect, 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 perfect. That is actually great. And we got a new officer. Lieutenant Commander James Hewitt. Final command 15%, fighter ops 10, promotion score 210. And Ashwick Glover. Increases fluid movement initiative. You go, Ashley. Do, do, do. Let's see. Let's see what the game has in store for us. While we stare at Earth. Now, the thing is, I would really like to finish that. Uh, times three minimum engine power modifier. Then I'm going to move to. Uh, and then I'm going to move the focus to the missile technology. Now, I have not been sure if I showed it or if I didn't. I think I did. Mm, I think I did. Yeah, uh, but we we have to quite quite improve our missiles before they will be of any use uh, because where we are now with the missile technology is not useful at all wasting resources on missiles that will just fly past your opponents is horrifying and I'm not actually thinking about uh, moving the focus from uh, lasers to missiles. Uh, I'm not saying that. But the planetary defenses, mainly in the colonies, 
should, in my opinion, use missiles because they can travel through atmosphere easily and of course if you're attacked by the enemy the missiles um, amount of missiles you have and you shoot at them should be capable of uh, destroying any uh, enemy missiles heading towards your uh, plan because it might be easy to miss a ship in space that is moving but trust me they won't miss our colonies and that's something we have to think about well, then commander James Hewitt oh we already had them so nothing's happening yeah it's just time increments telling me that we got harvesters full Actually, uh, once the game stops, I'm going to check if I can't set it to 90% or over. There probably is a setting. I don't think it has to be full. And we got Lieutenant Commander Norbert Nierboer joining our Naval Officer Corps. Initiative 160. Promotion score something something. Can't really see it. And we have lost the contact with Viking 4. Probably left the system. Okay, June will arrive soon. Yeah, money game. Show me what you got. Damn, but I don't remember the time increments taking so long. I guess I just... I'm no longer used to it. How did you guys cope with it? I mean, seriously. Uh, it might be also that I'm tired. I had a rough day at work. So I'm not patient as I probably ought to be. For training or experience, the Tenant Commander Mandeline Shaw has increased her training bonus to 25. You go, girl. I wonder how long it will take to build the tanker. Probably way longer than I would like it to. But that's a given. That's a given. Can we... What's the... I have to check what's the earth... Uh, Earth Cargo Task Group doing because I haven't gotten any message about finishing its orders. It's probably set to cycle. A sodium harvest of feed one has been given a conditional order to unload 90% fuel at not found and move to a gas giant. What? Voting reliability of the Tiny Commander Nathan Fuller Fuller has increased to twenty percent. Okay, game, you are pissing me off. Uh, what do you mean not found? At Barnard Star A one, into Barnard Star A two. Yeah, you're. Why not found? What do you mean by that? And Barnstar A1 is the one where we have a fuel. So, okay, that's not a problem. I don't really see that as a problem. Why not found? Maybe it's because it's not. It's an automated colony. So, the game might have a problem accessing the database. <laughs> Still, it's weird. Well, never mind. 27th of May. Let's continue. Let's see what the future holds for us. I bet it's roof less and it's going to hurt our feelings.
Come on, game. We're waiting for you. Everyone is waiting for you. Now nah, it's a curse of the game. It's going to get slower and slower. Thank God we got our dungeon master or space master who is cleaning up the database because otherwise it would be extremely slow, way slower than it is now. I know someone told me that it takes them like 20 minutes to process a turn. Okay, so the mining colony on Elfrosina has been expanded and we got another maintenance problem. Damn, 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 damn. These monitors are just falling apart. Lieutenant Commander Bobojinka Orlov. Wow. Mining 20 further ops, xenology, communication. Hmm. Bobojinka is not bad. It's not bad. 20th of July and 7th of September. And 15th of July. Oh, that's 2 2102. 2105. What are we waiting for with the monitors anyway? Is it engines? And... Uh, and... The fire control? The fire control definitely. Fire control definitely. Maybe their engine comes out forever hungry. God damn it, what was I thinking when I named that thing? Oh, fuel use, oh god damn it, well, fuel capacity 2 million liters range, 15.9 billion kilometers, it's way more than the monitor had, that's cool, we might bump that up a bit though, how are we doing, oh, yeah, it's, it's about, damn, It's way bigger than the original monitor. But it has way more fuel, one more turret. Extra fire control. Why am I putting extra fire control? I don't really know. Uh, and maintenance life 3.62 years. Average failure rate is increased. Hmm. Not that good though, it fires way more and yeah, we'll, have, we'll just have to change the engines, really. Is that the one we're producing? Yeah, we are. And we're hungry, yeah. So I'm preparing, I decided probably to use that engine. Though I could, could I wait for... Uh, it's just a minimal engine. That's that's not good. We would need this one, and that one is probably going to take a while. Let's just see how much. If we like to get away everything and put it into that one easy wincy technology, where is it? Shipbuilding. Um, maximum, no, here. So if we put 14 extra research labs there, it would still take over a year, so yeah, no. All of my nopes. The ceramic composite armor, though, would be good. But that's going to take over a year as well. I might just let these two run and make it an upgrade to the monitor later on. More efficient engines would go way forward for it. I already can tell you that. You know, that, that thing is going to... Did I see correctly that it had 2 million liters of fuel? So just launching 5 of them will take half of our fuel capacity. So... Yeah, there you go. And what's the last thing I put my technology points in? Damn, I forgot. Is it shipbuilding? I 
I think it was she building there. No. Yeah, it was. Oh, was that you? No, I think it was she building. Yeah, 745. Well, probably she building. Doesn't really matter. Uh, the other technologies are not that important. Okay. Well, let's continue. It's the 2nd of June.